guys welcome back to my channel thank you so much for watching today's video today i am doing the medical assistant tag and i was tagged by sophia danielle to do this video hey girl thank you so much for tagging me and to do this i loved your video i will have her her video and her channel linked down below as well as her as her instagram it is such a cute feed oh my god i love i love her she is adorable and so sweet uh there are 12 questions and we will get started in just a minute. But before we get started, I just want to put out a quick disclaimer for all my medical assistants out there. I'm so sorry. I know that your schools are on online now. Your clinicals are being canceled. Your externships are being postponed. Ugh, I can't imagine what you're going through. And I'm so, so sorry. But as we know, it's for your safety. It's for the patient's safety. It's for everybody's safety to be quarantined right now it is a really rough time in our country and if you don't know i'm in the u.s and we are just getting started with the pandemic that is going on with the covid 19. i'm not going to get into it too much the the news is full of information the cdc the world health organization Please check those websites and get all the information that you need, the most accurate and up-to-date information. It's constantly changing, so please stay on it. Um, it's, it's very bleak and the world is a very dark and scary place right now, but we will get through it. We'll get through it together. And I was really debating putting up any videos, but I'm like, you know what? I think now more than ever, we just, we need content out there. We need to feel some type of normalcy you know i know people are dying people are sick i hello i'm in the hospital all the time i i see it we're running out of supplies we're just it's it's really dark right now but we are gonna get through it we will together just be here for each other look out for your neighbors look out for the elderly and that's it okay and get off my soapbox because I'm going to start crying and we're not here for that. We're not here for that. We're here for the MA tag and that's what we're going to do. So let's get started. So I have my big ass jumbo tie. Oh no, I got out. No, 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 no. <laughs> I have um, Sophia's channel up right now. Hey girl. And she has uh, 12 questions. And first, a big shout out to Miss Ellie Young because she created the tag. Hey girl, I see you. And I love her channel. She has so many super cute DIY videos that I will be doing with my girls and my son. And she's just super cute. I love her. I love Sophia Danielle. Ugh, they're just awesome. And MA's rock. Okay, in case you didn't know, now you know. But let's go. There are 12 questions. Like I said, I think I said that three times. Uh, but here we go. The first question is, do you have a certificate or a degree? I have a certificate. If you've seen my How I Became an MA video, it's all in there on why I decided to go for my certificate. If you don't want to watch it, it's because, really stupid, it was only five month difference to get a degree, but I had to start working. So I'm like, five months is five months too long for me. I need to get my ass working. Next one, um, how long did it take you to become a medical assistant? Um, my program was about, shoots, eight or nine months, something like that, plus your uh, clinical hours, which we had to do 160 hours. Are you credentialed, and if so, through who? If not, do you want to become credentialed or certified? Um, yes, I am certified. I am through the AMT, the American Medical Technologist. And for those of you who aren't certified and want to be, I know if you are working and not certified, they can help you become certified without having to go to school. I know some places hire MAs and they train them, but they didn't have any like the proper schooling or whatever. AMT will help you get certified. Just throwing that out there for anybody who is looking to get certified. Uh, do you wear dance clothes or sneakers? Sneakers all the way. Dance clothes, hella expensive and hella uncomfortable. Hell no. Sorry, sorry, no hate to those who love and live by their dance clothes. I might have been saying that right. Dance clothes, dance clothes, whatever. No, never. What is your favorite brand of scrubs? So, 
full disclosure, um, my favorite are um, the Maven uniforms. Um, I, I really love their scrubs. They are really comfortable. But full disclosure, I do work with them. So I do have a couple that they sent me and a few that I have purchased on my own because I really did like the quality of their um, of their scrubs. I'm sorry, my camera's shaking. I'm not, I trying to uh, I have it leveled up and I'm shaking the table. Sorry. And I also like Cherokee. Cherokee, they have the best. Seriously, you can never go wrong with Cher Cherokee. Their Infinity line is really nice and really comfortable. I have a couple of their actual um, undershirts and they're really nice. The long sleeves, so I'm always cold. What is your favorite brand of Stethoscope? So my favorite is the Lipman. And this one is the... Oh, shit, my glasses. Um, this is the really pretty all black one. I really, I really like this one. It's really pretty. Um, I think this one was 120, I wanna say. Ugh, my hair. And I have my MDF. I really like this one, it's really pretty. It is the white and rose gold. But I really want the black and rose gold. Oh, that one's sexy, that one's so pretty. Um, I hear pretty well with this one. Um, I think the quality may be a little better in my Lipman. But the MDF one is really nice too. And this one was about $80 and I got it on Amazon. I will have it linked in my Amazon uh, store. I'll have it linked down below if you're interested in purchasing that one. Do you always, what do you always keep in your scrub pockets? Um, a pen, chapstick, my phone, and uh, usually a notepad or a sticky pad of some kind. Because I always have to write stuff down. Oh, I skipped the question. Do you prefer taking blood pressure manually or electronically? Um, both. I, I like both. My In my clinic, we do electronic. We have the uh, machine. But I do like manually because it helps keep up with your skill. And some patients require, not require, but they ask you, they prefer. I should say. Some patients prefer to have their blood pressure checked uh, manually. So it's good to know. Is there a certain task you really enjoy doing that is part of your job? Um, yeah, I like the procedures. I like, I like doing procedures. Those are a lot of fun to do. Is there any particular specialty you enjoy? Um, to be fair, I've only worked in one specialty, which is urology, and I really like it. I, I really like urology. I started in family medicine, then I was in internal medicine, which is adults only, and urology. I did not care for family medicine. I, it, it just wasn't my jam. Uh, what made you decide to want to become an MA? Um, and this actually goes number with the next and final question do you want to go back to school to become a nurse yes i want to go back to school to become a nurse and actually nursing was my actual first choice that's what i've have always wanted to do i became became nma kind of like just to get my foot in the door and make sure that that's what i wanted to do like i wanted to go into health care so kind of not to like waste my time and pursue nursing if it's not what I want, not what I expected it to be. And I know MA, nurse, oranges and apples, I totally get it. But just to see what healthcare was like. And I really enjoyed being an MA. So I think it was, has, and has always been the goal for, for me. For me. So, And that's it. That's, those are all the questions. And I hope you enjoyed this video and that it didn't bum you out too much in the beginning. And again, like I said, I'm not trying to offend anybody or seem insensitive. It's, I just wanted to kind of keep it going for myself, keep my sanity and for my kids and husband's sake, <laughs> keep my sanity in check. And just wanted to put out some, some stuff for you guys to watch. And like I said, any MAs that are out there, I'm um, rooting for you. You got this. I know it's hard, especially everything's been moved online. Your stuff's been canceled, but you will graduate. You will finish. I promise you. We are here for you. You have a whole community cheering you on, and 
you got this and that's a wrap for the ma tag i hope you enjoyed today's video again thank you so much to miss sophia danielle for tagging me and for mentioning me in her video i really appreciate it and to keep this going i tag alex the ma and senya rosas to do the ma tag i will have the questions linked down below and i will have all their channels down below thank you again to miss ellie young for creating the tag and i hope to see you guys in my next one